Despite its modest beginnings, the sport of octopush or underwater hockey is rapidly rising to the surface. It was invented in the early 1950s by sub-aqua divers in South Sea, England, who lacked diving equipment to cope with the cold seas in winter, needing something to pass the time during their dive club pool sessions. 50 years on and the game has spread to much of the world, from Australia to America, Canada to Colombia, New Zealand to the Netherlands. Underwater hockey is fast, furious and is certain to take your breath away. Players wear a diving mask, snorkel and fins, water polo hat and of course a swimming costume. They hold a hockey stick called a pusher in a gloved hand and use it to push, pass or flick a weighted puck between teammates to get the puck into the opposing team's three metre goal, called a gully, at the end of a 25 metre pool. Bournemouth and Southampton player Rebecca Lord explained the tough nature of the sport. Well, it's a, it's a three-dimensional sport. It's more than just the, um, the pitch. It's going up and down and timing your breaths right. It's very, very fast and very intense. Um, and it's, it's all about determination and staying on the bottom however much it hurts. You can't take a break while you're playing. It's, there's no sport as fast as underwater hockey is. The highly competitive nature of the sport and the unique demands it places on the human body mean that the health benefits from taking part are obvious. And you never know, the underwater world of octopus could soon be making waves at the pool near you.